today we're here back on the ferry from, from Sabre once again but today we're going to the island of Vieques. I think it's about 30 minutes and it costs uh, $4 round trip so it's a dollar cheaper than Culebra. So this is the place that we're going to be checking out in today's video. All right, so we just had a nice breakfast in a local joint there for like six dollars and now we're in a bit of a dilemma because we can get the vans to a beach, but the problem is then we'll just be stuck on a beach like we were yesterday, which I'm not really complaining about because that was an amazing beach to be stuck on. But we also at the same time don't get to explore the island properly. So we're thinking about renting a scooter here, but the problem is it's kind of expensive. It's like uh, $65, I think, for the day. But I think that's what we're gonna do. So we're just heading there now to see if that is really the price. We're here and it's like about eight o'clock now so yeah you can see everything's super quiet streets are all empty right now no real cars around really pretty chill place though all right this is gonna be our vehicle for the day ready to explore <laughs> It was actually $72 for the day after all the taxes and stuff. Puerto Rico always has this like 11% tax and everything. So yeah, now we're gonna explore the island a bit. So that thing was a lot of fun. I've never actually driven one of those before, so it's pretty cool. Really nice as well, because you get all the breeze right. It's very hot here. And we've just arrived at our first destination. I think it's called Playa Chivas. It's supposed to be a really nice beach. And another cool thing about renting these things is that they said a lot of the vans don't come to these like more remote beaches. So that's another reason to rent one. And all that part that you saw right now, like the beautiful green part, I think it's like a wildlife refuge, like pretty much half of the island is a wildlife refuge. Anyway, let's check out this beach. Nice. Alright, look at this. I think we're the only people here. <laughs> Us and these guys on the boat. <laughs> Yeah, this is really nice. This is really nice. Oh my god. All these plants as well. Don't think I've ever really seen a beach like that before. Also got these really nice, nice flowers everywhere. Check that out. Yep, real beautiful here. Very peaceful here indeed. I don't think we're gonna get in the in the water at this part. I mean, it's still pretty early, so 
probably do it later on at some other beaches when it gets like really hot and yeah I think we're just gonna go exploring a bit more now what's this crazy person doing <laughs> what's your problem <laughs> That's what happens when you bring her on nice beaches, she just loses her mind. <laughs> Alright, now it's Carol's turn on the wheel. Danger. Danger, danger. Last time I ever vlog. <laughs> come to the second beach probably gonna stay here for a while so this one is called Playa Caracas and I think this is like the most popular beach here see here you still got some wild horses this horse knows where the the good spot is <laughs> it's beautiful isn't it I wonder if you can pet it probably not right probably not. Uh, Maybe they're wild but friendly. What a surprise, another really beautiful beach. temperature always pretty warm still cools you down though and yeah you can see behind me once again even though this is the most popular beach still pretty empty it is a weekday I think it's Wednesday right now is it Wednesday Carol yeah <laughs> yeah I think it's a Wednesday and we're kind of out of season apparently here in November I think the busy season is June and July August and apparently it's kind of difficult to, to get on the ferry like because it's so busy but Everything's just been so nice, nice for us around this time. Weather's been beautiful for us as well. Apparently it was raining in the weeks before, but for us it's been completely sunny. It looks like it's gonna be like that for the rest of our trip. So yeah, just really lucky. So even here, you have some wild chickens on the beach. They're literally everywhere in Puerto Rico. No escape. The other one getting tan. Where? Oh yeah, this guy's getting his tan on. <laughs> this guy's about to steal all my vlogging equipment. Hey, get away. <laughs> Alright, so we spent uh, about, I guess, two hours on that beach there, just relaxing. And now we're heading into, I don't know if it's a town or a city, but we're heading to a place called Esperanza. And it's supposed to be like a cool, like, relaxed vibe place. We're gonna go there to, to have lunch, basically. So, I want a place with, like, smoothies and stuff like that. So we're heading there now. Come here to a restaurant called Duffy's. And I think I'm gonna go with the fish and chips for $11. Got a really nice view of the seafront here. All right, looks like a pretty good portion. Carol's salad looks amazing. What is that chicken salad? Yeah. How much was that? I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> Got a nice margarita as well. At the final beach of the day probably, don't think we got enough time for another one. 
Uh, I think this place is called Sun Bay. We were going to go to a place called Navio Beach, but then the terrain on the road was like too weird for this uh, golf cart. So we decided just to stick here. Either way, still insanely beautiful. Look at that. I don't think you'll find a bad beach here, to be honest. I was unable to fly my drone on the other beaches because they were in the wildlife refuge and there was um, there was a sign saying you couldn't but I think on this one I can so yeah at least I can get some shots now. nicest beach that we went to here just because of the views um, yeah the view in the background was really nice like the mountains but nothing beats Fly Playa Flamenco from yesterday's video in Culebra I doubt there's any beaches as good as that on Vieques uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about check out yesterday's video I'll link it at the end of this video that beach was amazing this ice cream store and me and Carol are very happy because they have acai, acai, strawberry, blueberry and banana. Carol's is like coconut, granola and banana. Mm. <laughs> this looks amazing. Let's try this thing out. We don't think it's like Brazil style though, no. What's different about it? Guarana. Oh, there's no Guarana. Yeah, maybe. Still delicious though, anyway. So we're gonna be heading back to the ferry now. It's been a really awesome day here. It's a place that I'd love to spend more time here to see some other places. Definitely recommend coming here for sure. And yeah, and also recommend renting out a scooter or, or a golf cart like us because it's the best way to see the entire island, obviously. So if you like this video, just drop a like on it. Subscribe if you like to see more videos like this. And I'll see you in the next one.